Welcome viewers, in this video we will see the number system used in the digital system. Subscribe the channel for more videos and notification. Soft copy of this material available in the drive. Link is given in the description box. Now we will go to the topic number system. So in digital electronics, the number system is used for representing the information. So all the informations are represented only by the number system in the digital electronics. The number system has different base and most common of them are decimal, binary, octal and hexadecimal. So there are four types available based on the number of bases, number of uh, number of uh, numbers, the base is there based on that we have decimal, binary, octal and hexadecimal. The base or radix of the number system is the total number of digits used in the number system. So, the base or radix refers the total number of digits available in the number system. Suppose, if the number system representing the digit from 0 to 9, so that is a normal we are using decimal number 0 to 9. So, totally there are 10 numbers available 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So, totally 10 numbers available. Then the base of the system is 10. Right? So, there are four basic types available, decimal, binary, octal and hexadecimal, all are differ by the base. Base means number of digits available in the number system. So, by using this different number system, we can represent the information in the digital electronics. Now, we will see the types one by one. So, the types of number system. The first one is the decimal number system. Normally, what we are using in your day to day life 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. So, totally 10 numbers available. So, that base is 10, right? So, the decimal number 10 different numbers available. So, it is represented by base 10. The second one is binary number system. Binary number means only we have 0 or 1, only 0 or 1, two, only 2 numbers available, 2 possibilities. So, the base is 2. For example, 0, 1, 1, 0. So, the base, this is the indication of the base. 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. So, this is coming under decimal number system having only 2 numbers, zeros and 1. So, that base equal to 2. The third one is the octal number system. The third one is octal number system having 8 different numbers 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7 there is no 8 available only up to 7 so there is 8 num different numbers available so the base will be 8 right 0 up from 0 to 7 all the digits from 0 to 7 have the same physical meaning as decimal number system so in the decimal also we are having 0 to 7 8 and 9 also available but here 8 and 9 is not available. So, up to 7, it is very similar to the decimal number system. The next, next digit in the octal number is represented by 10, 11, 12. Not suppose 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, right? Which are the equivalent to 8, 9, 10, right? There is no 8, 9, 10, in 8, 9. For that, we are using 10, 11, 12. The details available in the next one. We will see how we are getting 10, 11, 12 respectively. The fourth one is the hexadecimal number. Hexadecimal number means the base is 16. There are 16 in the digits available. This is the combination of number and alphabet. From 0 to 9, the total 10 numbers available and other 6 alphabets are available. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Total 10 numbers. A, B, C, D, E, F. There are 6 alphabets available. So, this hexadecimal number is a combination of number and alphabet. So, totally 16 numbers available, 16 div digits available. So, it is called a base 16. So, it is represented as base 16. So, we have 4 different number system, decimal, binary, octal and hexadecimal. Now, we will see the comparison of these, these 4, de 4 number system. First, first column refers the decimal then binary, octal and hexadecimal. 
right so in that decimal what we have 0 1 2 3 up to it will go like that in binary means that should be converted we will see how to convert this decimal to binary in octal system what we have 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 thereafter 8 and 9 is not available 11 12 is there so the, the, the system will not use 8 and 9 it will go to 10 11 12 like that right so it is goes to 10 11 12 13 14 15 up to 16 then 17 also available similarly hexadecimal number we have 9 thereafter a b c d e and f so this is the total tabular column available for the entire four different uh, number systems decimal binary octal and hexadecimal the decimal is normal 0 to 15 the binary will see how to convert this decimal to binary then octal the important thing is up to 7 thereafter we have 9 not available 8 9 9 not available we have 10 11 12 13 14 and 17 similarly hexadecimal is a very simple up to 9 thereafter 6 alphabets are available now we will see how to convert how we are converting the decimal to binary system so the one is nothing but 0 0 0 1 right now always we are using four digits it's called a binary coded decimal four digits standardly we are using how we are is how this one is represented at 0, 0, 001 this one should be divided by 2 we need to find how many times it is going what is the remainder so one it is while dividing two is not going so the zero the remainder is one so you have to write in this reverse order 0, 01 so the while writing in four digits it is 0, 0, 0, 001 similarly the number two this is a decimal number this is a binary number decimal number 2 what we need to do we need to divide by 2 so while dividing it is going one time remainder is 0 so you have to write in this order it is 1 0 while writing in four digit it is 0 0 1 0 we need to add two more 0 in the beginning so that we will get four digits similarly this binary number this decimal number 3 how to convert into binary divide 3 by 2 so while dividing it is going one time the remainder is 1 write in this order reverse order 1 1 while writing in the while writing in the four digit it is 0 0 1 1 not a 0 0 0 1 1 right so like that we can convert from decimal to binary we will go for other digits 4 and 5 so this 4 we need to divide by 2 it is going two times remainder is 0 again divide by 2 it goes one time the remainder is 0 so what is that we need to write in this order 1 0 0 while writing in four digit it is 0 1 0 0 right then 5 5 is the decimal number while dividing 2 it is going two times the remainder is 1 again dividing by 2 it goes one time the remainder is 0 write in the reverse order 1 0 1 one zero one while writing in four digit it is zero one zero one right now we'll go for the other numbers then six decimal number six divided by two it goes three times the remainder is zero again divide by two it goes one time and remainder is one so one one zero while writing four digit it is zero one one zero then seven decimal number 7 7 divided by 2 it goes three times and remainder is 1 again divided by 2 it goes one time and remainder is 1 right in this reverse order 1 1 1 while writing four digit it is 0 1 1 1 then decimal number 8 it is divided by 2 it goes four times the remainder is 0 again divided by 2 it goes two times and remainder is zero again divided by two it goes one time remainder is zero so while writing in reverse order one zero 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 so it is automatically it came four digits one zero zero right now we'll go to the numbers nine divide the number nine while dividing it goes four times remainder is one again divide by two it goes two times remainder is zero again divide by 2 goes one time remainder is 0 write in the reverse order 
Then 10, 10 is divided by 2, it goes 5 times, remainder is 0. Again divided by 2, it goes 2 times and remainder is 1. Again divided by 2, it goes 1 time, the remainder is 0. Right? So 1, 0, 1, 0. Then 11, divide by 2, it goes 5 times, remainder is 1. Again divide by 2, it goes 2 times, remainder is 1. Again divide by 2, it goes 1 time, remainder is 0. We are right in the reverse order. 1, 0, 1, 1. Similarly, we will go to 12 and 13. So, 12 while dividing 2, it is 6. Remainder is 0. Again, dividing by 2, it goes 3 times. Remainder is 0. Again, divided by 2, it goes 1 time. Remainder is 1. So, writing in reverse order, 1, 1, 0, 0. Right? Similarly, we will go to the 13. Well, the dividing by 2, it goes 6 times, the balance is 1. Again, divide by 2, it goes 1 time, balance 1. So, writing in reverse order, 1, 1, 0, 1, right. Now, we will go for the remaining. So, 14, 14 divided by 2, it goes 7 times, balance 0. Again, divide by 2, it is going 3 times balance 1 again divide by 2 going 1 time balance 1 so it is writing in reverse order 1 1 1 0 then 15 15 while dividing by 2 it goes 7 times balance 1 again divide by 2 it goes 3 times balance 1 again divide by 2 it goes 1 and balance 1 so 1 1 1 1 right 4 ones are available now we discuss how all the decimal, decimal numbers are converted into binary starting from 1 to 15, right. So now we will go to the decimal to octal, decimal to octal, how to convert decimal to octal, right. So this is the decimal number, this is the octal number. So up to 7 both are same, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7, that is 8 and 9 is not available, right, up to 7 both are equal after that it will not come 8 and 9 again the see this number will repeat it will it may repeat from 0 to 7 only it will not go to 8 or 9 then how will you convert this 8 number 8 decimal number so here divide by 8 in previous case binary we divided by 2 because binary base is 2 here octal the base is 8 so it is divided by 8 right the, wow, the we need to divide with the base number right binary divided by 2 similarly octal we have 8 numbers available so it is divided by 8 so while 8 divided by 8 goes one time the balance is 0 so we write in reverse order 10 so the octal number octal equivalent of the decimal number 8 is nothing but 10 10 right there is no 8 or 9 the 8 should be represented by 10 in the octal system Similarly, we go for the remaining, remaining the numbers. 9. 9 while dividing by 8, it goes 1 time and balance is 1. So, writing in the reverse order, we got 11. So, 8 is represented by 10, 9 is represented by 11. Similarly, 10, decimal number 10, divide by 8, it goes 1 time, the balance is 2. So, writing in the reverse order, it is 12. Then 11. While dividing into 2, it goes 1 time, the balance is 3. Writing in the reverse order, it is 13. See this, 10, 11, 12, 13, we are continuously we are getting 8, 9, 10, 11, it is represented in the order, right. Similarly, we will go for a 12, the number 12. While dividing 8, it goes 1 time, the balance is 4. Writing in the reverse order, it is 14. So, it is coming in the order, 11, 12, 13, 14. Now, we will go for the remaining numbers. So, the decimal number 13, while dividing by 8, it goes 1 time, the balance is 5. So, writing in the reverse order, it is 15. Then, 14, while dividing by 8, it goes 1 time, the remainder is 6, while writing in the reverse direction, it is 16. Right? The decimal number of 14, the octal number is 16. Then, 15, while dividing by 8, it goes 1 time, the balance is 7. So, while writing in the reverse order, it is 17. So, the decimal equivalent at 15 is 17. So, in this video, we discuss the number system. There are four type of number system. Decimal, binary, octal and hexadecimal. And we see, we, we discuss how to convert from decimal to binary 
as well as decimal to octal also how it is represented basic what is the basic procedure right and also we discuss the hexadecimal there are 16 digits available subscribe this channel for more videos and notification soft copy of this material available in the drive the link is given in the description box thank you for listening